back to my channel. As you can probably tell by the title of this video, I hate that I just said that, like everyone says that. Um, I am moving out, I'm leaving my home my home that made me i am literally leaving and do you know what i never thought that i'd see the day like i literally said to my parents like i'm gonna be here forever like i'm never gonna mo move out my mom treats me well you know cooks me dinner every night <laughs> why would i leave that why would i leave that um but yeah uh basically i'm sure that many of you guys have seen like the sidemen videos they're like oh i'm leaving the sidemen house and like Vix one for example he's moved out already um, and I'm sure that you're wondering what Josh is doing um, and yeah we're basically moving in together <laughs> literally how exciting like how freaking exciting is that like we've been together for it will be eight years I almost said eight months eight years in December and I know that that sounds like a really long time and it is but me and Josh have taken things so so slow um, and we found that that works for us you know everyone goes at their own pace that's fine um, but also like we were obviously like really, really young when, when we met I was 17 he was 18 so you know it made sense to go slow like what what like we weren't in a rush you know but yeah um, we are gonna be moving into a London uh, <laughs> I am so excited, we've actually found a place already and I'm so excited for it, like it's stunning and it's completely unfurnished. We've already bought a few bits, um, like a bed, a sofa and stuff but it's not arrived yet so once that arrives I guess that's when we'll move in, I don't know, like I really don't know. We've kind of spoke about oh like we'll move in in the new year and that's mainly because you know Q4 is always really busy for me working at Sidemen Clothing, it's like a hectic time at Christmas and for Josh as well, YouTube is like a very busy time in December so we was like, you know what, let's not rush it, Ofs. Um, let's not rush it and let's just move in in January, new year, fresh start me, 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 me. and yeah, buzzing, I'm actually so so gassed but it's, I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little bit overwhelmed because this room, you guys can't can't see it and I'm not gonna show you it. It's like a bomb's gone off, like it's so messy, I don't even know where to begin. It's quite stressful, but you know, I'm sure it'll be fine. I I sense I'm gonna throw a lot of stuff out. Like I've got so many like I've literally got a pile of clothes right here that I need to either give them all um give to charity or try and like sell some pieces because there's pieces in there that I've never even freaking worn, like why do I do that? But yeah, so like clearing everything out is a little bit like, Ugh. and this is gonna be like my first time living on my own. So obviously Josh has lived with the boys for like, I think it's been like five years, years now. So he moved out when he was 17, very long time ago. He was really, really young when he mo moved out due to like circumstances. Um, and yeah, so he's kind of used to either being alone because he moved, moved out on his own to begin with, or like being with friends and stuff and it's not, it's like quite an, a nice transition to make whereas I'm literally going from living at home with my parents to living with my boyfriend and I mean I'm really excited like don't get me wrong but you know it's a big step <laughs> It's a big step guys, a big step. But um, yeah, no, I'm looking forward to it. I honestly didn't know when this day would come. It was really weird because we both kind of came to the decision that we want to move in together at the same time. So it was like, it was about half a year or to a year into the house that he's in currently. We both kind of just spoke about it and we were both on the same page and we was like, yeah, like when this rent is up, then we'll do it and it, we just kind of naturally you know like came to that agreement and before then I honestly like you aren't gonna like believe a word that I say but I honestly was so calm about not do you know what I mean like I wasn't in a rush to move in if that makes any sense I was just happy taking things as they came you know taking like baby steps because I don't want to rush into something that we're not ready for but no we both came to this decision at the same time and yeah it's gonna be a big step for me it's gonna be a big step for me um and I think my actual moving day is gonna be like emotional like I'm gonna have to have to say goodbye to my parents which gonna be weird I have to say goodbye to my cats dramatic as fuck like 
I don't know, man. It's a big deal. Also, I don't want any of you to be like, Oh, she's... She's blow up the side, man. It, like, she's the reason why they're all mo moving out. Like, that is so far from the truth. It hurts. Like, it's so far from the truth. Like, as you can see, Vic couldn't wait to leave. <laughs> Vic was like, zoop, I'm gone. Like, he found a place, literally, like, a few days later, he was gone. Like, you know, I think it just, they just wanted, you know, to move on. And, like, they were obviously still going to be the side men and still, like, do videos and all that stuff. It's going to be, like, still calm in that respect. They're just, you know, growing up. Like, Josh is 26, Simon and JJ are both 26 as well. Vic is just, like, he just wanted to live on his own. Like, he just loves his own space, and I fully respect that. So, yeah, it wasn't me. I am not behind this mastermind, like, I swear to God. <laughs> so, don't come for me. But, yeah, no. Um, I'm really, really excited to, like, furnish the place because I've obviously never done that as well. And it's really weird because you kind of feel like you have a style and you kind of feel like you know what you like. But you don't so I've literally been like okay like this is the style I want but then when you actually go to do it you're like um actually I don't know what the fuck I want like I don't know what I want I have no idea me and Josh contemplated like getting an interior designer but I don't know I'm kind of more lean leaning against that now because I I am slowly starting to bring it all together we've got a theme you know we've got a theme going on i don't know if we're gonna give a a tour or not um we've not spoke about it so if we do then you'll see a tour um but if not then soz but we are very private people so um i don't know if we will or not but yeah this day well not this day um our moving day has definitely been highly anticipated like or, or like it's been eight years so it's definitely the next step, you know? Like, for the past year, we've both kind of felt like, well, I know that I have, kind of, like, stagnant, you know? Like, we need something new, something exciting. Um, we just need to take that next step. And honestly, I couldn't be more excited and more, like, positive for the whole thing. Um, as I've said already, it's going to be a huge thing for me mo moving from my parents' house in with my boyfriend. But I feel like I know him really well, so I'm, don't, I'm not really worried on that front. Like, I'm not worried that we're going to, like, clash or I'm going to find out these nasty little habits that he's got. Because I feel like I know him so well. Like, I see him, like, three or four times a week. So, I feel like I know him, you know? Um... So I'm not entirely worried about that. It's more just, what if I get homesick? What if I get home homesick and I'm just like, nah, you know what, I wanna go home. What if? Like, I don't know, I don't know what I'm gonna be like. <sighs> but I guess it's all a, um, a learning curve and yeah, I guess we'll just see how it goes. But yeah, so soon I'm gonna have, have? I'm gonna have like a brand new setup. I don't know where I would film um we've got three bedrooms so we're gonna have a guest room and we're also gonna have an office which is gonna be josh's uh, which obviously makes some complete sense so i might put like i might buy i might invest in a computer and put it in the spare room um and film in there i feel like as well it's gonna motivate me living with josh as well like obviously he does youtube full time so being around him all the time as well i don't know I may get more consist consistent with my videos, um, not making any promises, but yeah, I don't know, I feel like I will. I just feel like nature's gonna take its course and I'm gonna upload more, you know? Like, I just feel like that's gonna be a thing. But yeah, anyway, I am fully, fully rambling. Um, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you have any questions, obviously feel free to leave them below. As I've mentioned already, we are very private people, so I'm not gonna tell you where we're moving, uh, you know, I'm not going to delve into that kind of era. As I've said, I don't even know if we, we're going to give like a tour of our place because, um, you know, we're very private people. So I don't know if that's going to be a thing either. I think, I think we'll know like when we move in and like once we're settled and like we're in the swing, I think we'll just have a discussion and be like, Sh shall we show it? Nah, yeah, nah, I don't know. We'll, we'll see, innit? Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you next time. Bye.